If this diary is ever found, I would like my parents to be remembered. Felix and Rebecca Jones were two amazing people, possibly the most amazing people ever to live on this rock. They met when my dad was a penniless law student and my mum was a shop girl, and this was years before block shopping. This was 2009. By 2014, my father was working for Westminster, and he married my mother, and a year later I was born. My dad was brought up as a devout Catholic, and so was I. I went to Catholic school, and where they taught me about God and chill like that. And, yeah, he was one of the first to find out about the alien contact. <clears throat> and when they landed on Earth, my dad drew up plans for this place and dragged me out of school, saying the Ceruleans weren't safe, they were dangerous. But after he spend, spent time with them, he realised that they weren't dangerous and that maybe what he knew was the truth wasn't. And by 2030, this place was finished, but by then he didn't care. He didn't think we'd ever need it because Earth was a good place to live back then. So yeah, he gave up his faith and started the Freedom for the Future Foundation. It was a foundation to help people adjust from religion to the reality we now, we now face. And within the first year they had over a million members, but also attracted a lot of attention from people who weren't willing to give up their outdated beliefs. When the war began uh, in 2041, my parents were one of the first to cap be captured. I think because they had the foundation and they were quite prominent and known, the rebels thought that they would be good examples. I watched them die on HV. It was televised across the world and I watched their throats being slit. Some kind of hark back to a sacrifice in a lamb or some shit like that. And there was nothing anyone could do. Um, they thought that they would get more members for their rebel cause, which they did, but they also outraged the rest of the planet. And so the war raged on. They were amazing people, my parents. And I miss them every day. And they were good people, good, honest people. And no matter what happens to me, I hope that memory lives on. <laughs>